Hi everyone, welcome to our channel, Rebecca Stu and the crew. I'm Rebecca and today's Friday, so we're going to show what's new at the Dollar Tree for the week of September 24th. So let's go shopping. Over in apparel and accessories this week, they had these new hats for winter. You get the red and black. They also had it in a solid blue knit. They had the light pink knit and then you could also get it in black and gray. They had a bunch of different gloves out as well and a bunch of their snuggle do socks. They have the buffalo plaid in quite a few different colors and then the solids. They also had some stripes and then some new socks. You get two in a pack. These are a bright fluorescent sock. You get a solid pair or one pair that has a different saying on the bottom of them. And here are all the different colors you can get and sayings with the different solid color socks. They also had these really cute little animal socks. They have these fuzzy ears at the top. And I believe there's about five different pairs all together. They're a little bit taller of a sock, about mid um, shin. And then they also had in some more of the Fruit of the Loom socks. They're an extra thick sock and you get one pair for a dollar. They had the men's socks in black, white, or gray in a three pack and a bunch of different um, hose sizes and colors. And some of them even had the tummy shapers in them, which were new this week. And they had some bandanas that were the red and black buffalo plaid and these extra large tote bags. Um, there were quite a few. They say different things like choose kindness, enjoy every moment, and different just things about um, inspiration and dreaming and things like that. So over in the arts and crafts supplies, they had these new um, dry erase board houses and some of them had chalkboards which were really cool. I found these chalkboards that hang. They're still in the box. They hadn't taken them out yet. There's two different ones of those and then they had these wood cutout pieces that look like houses that you can decorate yourself. They're about an inch thick and also these wood panels. They're about 18 inches long so it's a nice wood panel. They had these DIY rainbow and cloud. They had a crown. You could also get this large paw print and then they had some fence pieces, which were really cute. Then in the MDF board, they had some emoji faces that you could decorate, an extra large flower. They also had the sand castle and the little red truck, which we saw last week. They brought in some more of the craft wood pieces. There's a whole bunch of varieties there. And then these large boxes here with the little tag holder in the front, they actually come in three different sizes. And these are selling like hotcakes. People really like them. I'm not sure what they're doing with them. I'm going to have to check that out online. So then they had these extra large metal words. Usually they just have two. This week they had four different ones. So it was nice to see them get some new ones in for those. And then the galvanized metal signs. They had quite a few of those. Some in different shapes like flowers and clouds. They had a mason jar. And then some that just looked like a sign that you would decorate to hang. So a lot of them have the smooth surface. And then like last week I showed you, they also had the corrugated metal. Then they brought back a bunch of their crafters twine. This is the baker's twine. They have it in a bunch of different colors. Their chalkboard tags, they brought those back in this week. They haven't had these for quite a while. You get four in a pack. They have some of the Cricut or cutting machine tools. They had the scraper this week and some of these die cut words that say things for Father's Day that you could put on like coffee mugs and things. And then they had a bunch of the pearl um, adhesive dots. You can get them in light pink, dark pink. I found them in purple and green. I think they might have had blue, um, but I'm not sure. I didn't see it this week, but I thought I saw it last week. They also had a bunch of these packs of stickers. It's got like a clear backing on some of them. So when you peel them off, you could put them on like glass and you wouldn't see the border. And then other ones have the white border around them. So it really just depends on which package you purchase. There's quite a few new packs of these stickers here. And then they also had these extra large wall creation stickers by Main Street. And they had um, like Paw Patrol and some of the baby shark stickers. They restocked their marbles. So usually they just have the flat glass discs. Around Christmas time, they always seem to get the round marbles and you get the solid color or their multicolor packs. They had a bunch of their paint restocked this week and a lot of the packs of the glitter paint. So they don't always have the glitter paint. But this week they did have it in the purple glitter. They had silver, gold, red, and green. I'm sure gearing up for Christmas crafts. They finally brought back the chalk paint as well. It's been a while since they've restocked 
chalk paint. It usually sells out pretty quickly. These orb high def creation systems, you get 12 posters, but you do need to find the special crayons that go with it. They also had these velvet shaped stand up um, to color your own stands. It's like a 3D effect. It comes with the markers. So they had the llama, a unicorn. They also had a dinosaur and a mermaid. And then they had a bunch of these Halloween colored yarn. They had orange, purple, green, black, and white. I also found a bunch of this um, ribbon and a bunch of different fall colors, which was nice. They haven't had a variety of color like this in ribbon for quite a while that wasn't completely sheer, at least at our Dollar Tree they haven't. And you get nine yards for a dollar. Again, they had their springtime looking flowers all restocked as well. Over in the baby care, they had restocked the burp cloths. You get four different ones for a dollar. They had a bunch of the small hair clips for tiny little ones, and I just think those are so cute. They had quite a few different varieties of those, and then they had some new creamy baby oil by Baby Love and these adorable little teddy bears and puppies. I actually bought some. We're going to do a DIY video with those in a week or so. So over in the health and beauty aisle and cosmetics first, they had quite a few different e.l.f. products. They had these jelly highlighters in three different colors and you get those in the point, point 0.44 fluid ounce bottles. They also had this e.l.f. activation stick. It's for um, like when you work out so that you don't get clogged pores. And then they also had the Stardust Glitter in the Bronze Comet. That was the only color glitter that they had, but they had quite a few different highlighters. They also had the Cover Everything Concealer in a couple different skin tones and a bunch of different e.l.f. lipsticks. They had this lip liner with a smudge brush at the end. They only had those in a brown color, but there were quite a few of those at the store that I was at. And then they had the e.l.f. foundation. They had a couple different um, skin tones in that as well, and they had quite a bit of those. They had the e.l.f. Um, lashes. You get it with a tweezer. It says it's a lash kit, so it comes with the tweezer. They have the color correcting sticks and some of their makeup brushes. So lots of e.l.f. products this week. They also had the LA Colors Lip and Eye Color Studio. They're in these pop-up cardboard um, boxes. They have quite a bit of the different nude type lipsticks. They have the Lip Mousse. These are the plumping lip gloss. And then they have a bunch of the regular type eyeshadow. You can get the four count of the Smoky. They have Rose, the Bear Palette. And then this palette was called heat they also had the metallic eyeshadow and the auto um, liners that they usually sell off and on throughout the year a bunch of different mascaras and the la colors glow in the dark um, press on nails and nail polish they also had this vaseline lip therapy soothing sticks you could get it in the mint they also had it in the original a rose it was called Rosy Lip. It gives it like a light pink appearance. And they also had the aloe vera. They also had the Lip Smackers Coca-Cola 3-pack of lip balm. And that is a dollar for the three. And these really cute pedicure sets. You get five pieces for a dollar. They had one that had like um, ice cream cones, the summer vibes with the sunglasses, and the avocado. They had some cuticle remover with aloe vera. And these nail wraps, you get the blue and yellow with the daisies, the pink here with the butterflies. They also had the watermelon and these look like little citrus, like lemons and things like that. A whole bunch of these one step gel nail polish that you do not need a UV light with. So I thought that was kind of neat. This is just called the eye glow gel. I actually purchased one to see how it works. They had the Eye Glow Fashion in the three count pack boxes back in. These make great stocking stuffers. And then they had the larger Gel Kiss nail polish in a few different soft pastel colors. Last week they had out their Christmas colors. This week they restocked the pastel colors. I also found some of the new color brush on nail glue. And then they had the diamond three pack of nail buffing system. Over in the hair care this week, they had a bunch of different um, scrunchies in the Stylin brand. You get three for a dollar. They had their extra large jumbo hair twist scrunchies and some of the scrunchie 
uh, brand as well. And they have the three packs and the soft pastels and nude colors. And then a bunch of the packs of the um, barrettes. You get two barrettes for a dollar. They carry these from time to time. These are the smaller sizes. If you find the larger ones, you just get one for a dollar. And then the scunchy head wraps. They had those in red and green for Christmas. And a bunch of packs of these barrettes. You get them in the brown and black. And there are a bunch of different styles, size, and varieties. Depending on the size, depends on how many barrettes you get in each package. They also had some of these hair clips here. I highly recommend cleaning these when you get them home. I've been at Dollar Tree several times and seen people taking them out of the packaging and trying them on. So please, as a hairdresser, clean them when you get them home before you use any of the hair products. They also had in the pharmacy care this week, they had um, these bath bombs, which I showed you guys last week, but this week they put out some new ones. They had the Airheads, Icy, and Smarties. And then they also had these new shampoo pumps, which was a great buy for a dollar. You can put these in just about any size bottle of the shampoo and conditioner. They had some shower fizzies in the eucalyptus and spearmint. And then a bunch of the exfoliating bath gloves, cloths, and mittens. They had the lavender infused ones, which are all in the purple. And then the cream colored ones here, these are all the coconut infused. And the coconut, they also had the towel for your hair. And then the argon oil infused is the light blue color. And they had these miniature containers. You get three for a dollar. And they have two with the pink lid, one with the blue. They had a bunch of these men's fragrant gift sets. You get four different ones and there's two um, pieces in each gift box. Those also make really nice stocking stuffers. And they had some new body spray by the Power Stick for her. And they also had some new aromatherapy slumber um, bath or body wash. They had a bunch of different lever conditioners, body wash, and the suave conditioner, body wash, and shampoo. So there's a whole bunch there. They also had the bath crystals, which were new this week. This one's called the rose scented. And you get, it's like the darker pink bath salts. In the orange container, this was the sage and cedar scent. The purple was the lavender. And then the light pink one here is the peony scented. And those are nice large bottles and the labeling is really pretty. They also had their um, contact cases. They had some new ones in this week that I hadn't seen before. And now we'll move over into the fun finds this week. So this week they had these adorable succulent planters that look like the little trucks or campers and trailers. So they have the blue and red trucks. You could also get the blue trailer and the blue camper. You just get one in the box for a dollar. Here's what the red one looks like. They're not painted the best, but if you wanted to, you could actually spray paint these a solid color and then paint it yourself to make it look a little bit more um detailed here's the camper here or the rv that they have here's a view of it from the front and here's the side view here's a view from the top and then there's the trailer which i thought those were cute here in dallas we also had these um cowboy signs which I thought was kind of neat. They had two of those and a bunch of these door hangers. There's four different ones. They have the panda bear and it says it's so good to be home. The cat, which says meow or never. They also had the unicorn and it says choose to be happy. And the last one was the llama and it says you are amazing. So over in the home decor this week, they had these adorable little votives here with the wooden stands. You could get them in the natural wood or in the black. They're like the regular size votives that they usually carry. They also had these glass jars in the clear, green, orange, and yellow. And then a bunch of their iridescent globes, these extra large vases, which were so pretty. I actually purchased the blue one and I use it to store my makeup brushes in my bathroom and then I got these extra large vases. There's four different ones. I purchased 
one of the white ones. They're a really nice large size. They have the incense holders. They had two different ones. I've never seen this one here. Um, it's a little bit more plain. And then they have the decorative flower one. They also had these thinking of a master plan signs back in and a bunch of their pillows. These are the small pillows. They come in four different colors. And these candles that say home. There's four different ones of those. The purple one was the cherry blossom scent. In the green, it's rosemary and thyme. The uh, peach colored one is called sweet berries. And the purple or the blue was the lavender breeze. They had a bunch of their large votive candles with the decorative wrap or the plain. Last week, I showed you guys a bunch of the ones with the marble effect. This week, they had like mandalas on them. They brought back their special moments mirrors in the gold and in the silver. There's quite a few of them. Those are all just restock items. They had these new baskets. They've had these baskets before, but never in the two-tone color. So I thought that was kind of neat that the darker color is on the bottom. Then they have the lighter color on top. And I only saw them in the pink and in the gray. They also had a bunch of these bins back in this week in a bunch of different sizes. And a bunch of their prints in the frames. So they had a lot that looked more like a farmhouse type uh, feel to them. And then, of course, a few that have like kitchen sayings, quite a few about different things like family and things like that. So there's a whole bunch of varieties of those. I just took a picture of a few that were towards the front so you guys would get an idea of what was out. So now over in the housewares, home maintenance, organization, and electronics, they had these all-in wash um, scented crystals. They have... These are kind of like the downy ones that you can put in. They smell really good. There's three different versions, and I did purchase them. They work really well. They also have these gel packs. Uh, you get 16 for a dollar in this new laundry stain remover. It does say to test it on your material before you use it, and they had some new awesome tub and shower cleaner out this week. I also found this Odoban. It's a... Um, disinfectant spray and some new Brillo basic scrub squares. They also had some new incense holders that are just like a solid piece of wood that's painted and it's got this engraved um, marks throughout. Comes with the incense sticks as well and there's quite a few different scents of those. They brought back the large bins which are the tie dye. There's three different versions of those with the uh, different colors on the front and the bins come in either pink or in blue. They had these bins back in in the blue and the gray with the gold accents on the front and a bunch of different phone accessories. These are the over-the-ear earphones. They have them in four different colors and you could also get them in the clear type plastic and they come in the same four colors. They had some new air fresheners um, for your car or for the home and then those were called the California version and then they had the um, American flag air fresheners for a dollar. A bunch of their work lights were back in. I actually have some of these. They're really nice. And the desk lamps, they have restocked as well. Over in the kitchen and pantry this week, they have these Reynolds uh, kitchen baking sheets. What's nice about them, they have these little grids on them. You can use them up to three times. They brought back the um, plastic containers where you have the little dip cup for like vegetables and snacks and things. They also have these portion containers with the blue lids. Those are nice for like lunches and things like that. They had a bunch of those. And then the vegetable and dip container. I only found them in the green, but then they had these cutting trivets with the glass. They had welcome to my happy place in the blue and family is everything in the buffalo plaid. You could get those in the square and the circles. They also had the buffalo plaid drying mats out this week, which means the dishes won't be far to follow. They'll probably be out very soon. And a bunch of these coffee mugs with the monogram letters, which I thought were so cute. A bunch of these um, strawberry and chocolate syrup, the couscous, and some watermelon cotton candy. They also had these energy lattes in caramel, mocha, and vanilla. So now we'll move over into the office supplies, home library, and teaching tree. They had quite a few different magazines and cookbooks out this week and then they also had just a ton of their books so some of them are the books based on movies and it shows you how they make all the different scenes in the movies those books are originally like 50 dollars, and now they're just a dollar and a ton of different novels and books that you could read a lot of them came from target and all just a dollar so there's lots of versions of these these would make great gifts as well um 
or even just to buy to donate to like different places around the holidays I think would be nice. They have these large dry erase boards and they also have some new notepads. Um, the covers on them are so pretty. They have these really decorative um, pictures with different sayings on the front and then you get 52 sheets in each um, notebook there. So over in the party supplies they had some new tiara headbands. You could get them in yellow, pink, or in silver. They also had the happy birthday banners in the white, black, and pink with the gold accent. A bunch of these pop-up snack containers. They had them in red. You could also get them in green. They had blue and gold and you get five in each package. A bunch of these large decorative shirt boxes and their Christmas ribbon with the glitter for gift wrapping. They already have those out and then they have a bunch of their bows out as well. In the pet section this week, they've restocked these collar um, bow ties. They're so cute. You get two for a dollar. They have quite a few different versions of them and those are hanging on the plastic strips down the end of the aisle or in the middle over by like the food bowls and things. Then they brought back their scarves, which I just love for the pets. They have two different versions. I think these are so fun even to use for crafting if you don't have a pet. They have these large pet bowl placemats in the gray. They have them for the cat and the dog. They also have um, it in red, like a dark like magenta pink color, a teal blue, and dark navy blue. They used to have it in a light brown, but I didn't see any of the brown ones out this week. So I actually purchased these to do a craft with as well. Then they had these large um, dog toys out. It has like a rope tassel on the bottom of them for a dollar. They had a bunch of their harness um, harnesses. They had collars and some leashes and they were all the really thick ones which were the extra large ones for larger dogs. And they restocked a bunch of their toys for the cats and the dogs. And now we'll move over into seasonal. They are still putting out some of the fall items even though they have out their Christmas items. They restocked the Crafter Square Rub-On Transfer Sheets for glass. I actually use these in a craft. We put them on wood. So you don't have to just put them on glass. You're not limited to just that. Um, they'll pretty much go on any surface. Um, you might want to seal it with some Mod Podge, but they will go on just about any surface. And then they restocked their sunflowers in the two different sizes. They actually restocked a lot of their fall items, as well as the decorations and the crafting items. They put out some new pieces like the party favors that look like the fake syringes. They um, just put out these skulls on the stands, a bunch of these um, cups with the straws. You can get the skull in the silver or the iridescent look. They have the jack-o'-lanterns as well. They had their uh, little metal pails. Some of them have more of like a Halloween feel to them. And then just this one had the fall, um, like Thanksgiving type pictures on the outside. They have the planners with the scarecrow, the owl, the sunflower on the front. They've had these before in the past. They restocked their glitter ribbon and the Halloween colors and a bunch of their large wired ribbon they've restocked as well. Then I found these new glass jars. They were over by the dish sets and like the wine glasses and things. They weren't over by the Halloween items. They had them in clear or in the orange. They had a bunch of different treat sacks and treat bags. These are like the paper style lunch sacks. And then they had more of like a gift bag. You get three for a dollar. So they had the three with the pumpkins or these three with the different ghosts. And then this week they put out some of these reflective style trick or treat bags, which are a little bit more sturdy than the other bags they usually put out for trick or treat. They had some more of their costume items. They had the deer ensemble, some more of the plastic masks that look like a shark. These are the costume accessory and face mask kits. They had a nurse and a cat. And then they had a bunch of their tutus and a bunch of different colors. Their wigs that come on a headband. Some of the fairy wings in the purple, blue, pink, and green. And then these are air fresheners. They have the Day of the Dead in pink and in yellow. 
these glass tea light votives the um pumpkins here they had the white and gray with the little triangle cutouts in the front here's a view of them from the back they also had it in the navy blue and the pumpkin orange And these candle votives they've had out um, the last few years, you could get it in the dark red, the orange, they had it in dark yellow and navy blue. And they all come with that little leaf charm and ribbon at the top. And these are the two light candle leaves. Uh, they have those in four different colors as well. I really love the navy blue that they have out this year. I think it's just a little bit different. And I really like seeing that. Here are some new coffee mugs with the plastic top and the hand a uh, little cozy around it so there's four different ones there they have the blue that says pick of the patch the one with the green that has all the fall flowers on it the buffalo plaid and then the um, little gnomes they have their um, tumblers as well with the straws and some new towels out this week that say give thanks and hello fall with either the wheelbarrow or the blue truck in the farm in the background they have the oven mitts to match those and then the doormats they have the hey there pumpkin gather here and then the red truck that says hello fall and now for the winter items that they have out in seasonal this week they put out some more of their yard stakes with the gnomes and the towels with the blue they have their miniature Christmas trees in green and in white. And I do know that they're putting out these um, farmhouse style metal collars to go around the little trees. I saw them in the box. They hadn't put them out on the shelf yet. So hopefully we'll see those next week. They also have these snowman wreath forms, a bunch of their ribbon. This is like a mesh style ribbon they have in gold, green, red, and silver. And then the glitter wired ribbon. They also have the large jingle bells in green, red, gold, and silver. And here are the DIY wood pieces. They have the extra large snowflake, the houses. They also have the Santa, the snowman, some of their Christmas trees and gingerbread men, the little red truck with the tree in the back, some large stars and then these are the jointed elves here's a close-up view of the elf and they have the snowman and the santa which we saw last week then for the floral they have the berries with the greenery it has a little bit of glitter they have the white and red berries these are just some of the glitter greenery there they have these new eucalyptus in the gold and the silver and then the glitter um, stems here the one i really like this year that was new was the one that has like um, this teal blue color it's so pretty um, i hope you guys can find it because i just had it out at two of the stores i went to this week and they had a bunch of their glittered berries and uh, branches their pole noodles in the Christmas colors. They even have out their Christmas cards. They had a bunch of these bottle brush trees. They have them in this really pretty pink. They have green, gold, white, silver, and some of them have blue. Some of them are wrapped with the beads around them already for a dollar. They all have this little wood base at the bottom, which is nice. I love these trees with like the cutouts. Some of them have some um, little ornaments on them. And here's that little wood base there. So they have a lot of them. And then these are more like just a round circular pom-pom type style. And they have those in all the different colors. They have blue, red, gold, silver, and green. And they all look like they're covered in snow on the tips of the little branches there. I actually purchased one of the trees and the planters there. They have their plush elves, which I know people like to cricket. They have the boys and the girls. And now we'll move over into the toys, games, and entertainment. So again, they have these little dogs. But they also have these little teddy bears with the yellow tummies. And then they had some new slime in these um, skeleton heads here in red, yellow, and black. Some new lizards or alligators. They have a few different ones in the box. They're the hard plastic. 
I believe there were four different ones in that set that they just put out. They also had these magnetic games. There's four all together. You can get chess, four in a row, which is like connect four checkers and tic-tac-toe and the tower blocks and the large boxes, a bunch of different puzzles. They have some new ones for the new movies that are out. And then this large two liter bottle of bubble replacement. They also have the large bubble ones. And then some little decorative jewelry. These flasher hoppers that so they actually light up. They have their broom and dustpan set and a whole bunch of movies. These were all up in the front. Those are the featured item for the week. And then in select stores, they have the Dollar Tree Plus items, which are either three or five dollar items. So they had these large scrapbook plastic containers for scrapbooking. They're 14 by 14 inches for three dollars. This is a great buy for three dollars. It's a really nice plastic case. And then they had these large Better Home and Garden braided throws. Those were five dollars. A whole bunch of these Texas pillows, throw blankets and neck pillows. Those were all $5. And this five pack, this $5 pack of washcloths, you get 12 for the $5. They had these DIY crates that you could make. These were three. And these extra large teddy bears. Those were $5. Did you enjoy this video? Please check out some of our other videos. If you did, here's our craft video for the week that we just posted yesterday. We have a bunch of other DIY videos. We post those every single Thursday. And we post the Dollar Tree videos every single Friday. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And here are those other videos from our channel you might also enjoy. I hope you all have a lovely weekend and I'll see you back here next week.